Hey guys, how are you doing today? Hope you are keeping well. Uh, I want to give you just a few insights about some bumps ahead of you. Often, young people make mistakes and it's important that you get to know what are these bumps that I might or am I like, I'm likely to find near, in the near future or, I'm, or I've already, some of us have already found them. But uh, in the context of this, allow me to read for you a scripture that I found uh, relevant for this uh, uh, take. Proverbs 16 verse 1 the, uh, to 3, the Bible says, The plans of the mind are orderly, thinking, thinking belonging, belong to man. But from the Lord comes the answer of the tongue. All the ways of man are pure in his own eyes, but the Lord weighs the spirit the thoughts and intents of the heart. Roll your works upon the Lord, that is, commit and trust them wholly to him, and he will cause your thoughts to become agreeable to his will. And so shall your plans be established and succeed. So that's, uh, that is one of my favorite scriptures that I actually learned when I was a little a, a bit younger, uh, in my youth days. Uh, apparently, there are some... Uh, bumps that you shall find in your life now i want to go through them quickly there are seven of them i want to give you the first one is the bump that we call lack of trusting in god now that i've already read through that scripture that if you find yourself not trusting in god in your life that's the first bump that you make you have an accident accident number two is caused by lack of purpose or purpose in your life. The moment you find yourself not having a purpose of what exactly you want to do, now that becomes another bump in life. So what happens like that verse we have read says that your plans can only succeed if only you have a purpose. So that is if you have trusted in God. Number th uh, three is what I call focus. Often young people lose focus. And what is most important to know that focus is that engine that drives you to your focus and your purpose. So focus is very important. And all successful people have been asked that question many times and they always say that if you want to be successful, focus into your goal. Number three, and that's number four, waste of time. If you waste time, means that you do not use your time well. And it means that you will always find yourself hitting that bump. So time is the of essence. And I want to remind us here that you are in that time of your life, what I call the bridge. You are crossing from where you are, you are to a future where you will be expected or you, people will be depending on you. So it's important that you always remember that in this bridge, I need to actually be focused. Number uh, five is that you got to learn to listen. Now, listening is a skill. The, I call it the bump because if you do not learn to listen to people who are ahead of you, then obviously you end up making the same mistake that they made. So learning to listen is important. So once you listen, then it means you will always be able to learn from other people's mistake. The other thing, which is number six, is neglecting your own health. And many young people are wasting away because they are living lifestyles that are not good. That's a bump. If you are actually neglecting your health, you have your into habits and behavior that is actually going against your good health, then that's a bump. It's gonna make you fall. It's gonna make you make an accident. Some of us are maybe are involved in habits that are not good, doing things that are not right. Now those things, that is a bump that is will lead you astray. And lastly, and I call this the very last one, is what I would call failure to remain faithful to yourself. Always be faithful to yourself. Now life, guys, is tough. Life seems chisel. And if you're not faithful to yourself and you're looking up at other people to watch over you, it's going to not happen. Everybody has their own life to live. Remember that life is about you. 
you will call the shots of your life, you'll be expected to make decisions, and these decisions will, will at the end of the day, be, you will be answerable to them. There is nobody who carries you all your life. By the way, even your parents, they look forward when you will be independent. Nobody wants to carry you all your life along. Now, unfortunately, many of us think we have a lot of time. You don't. Very soon, there are guys who is an army that is behind you. And I want you to look, to just go and search at your age and ask how many people are, even I'm 20 years, ask yourself, go and search and find out how many people are 20 years and below. There's a huge army that is younger than you. So don't sit there thinking that you are very young and wasting up your time. So make sure you do not waste away because you are you, you, you have an opportunity to make your life today. I hope you will find out, check those bumps. They don't become uh, hindrances to your success because God has a good plan for you. So may uh, Proverbs 16 be your portion today. Thank you very much and I hope that will help someone. God bless you. Thank you.